As you know, these four Moog Mother 32s are set to their own individual MIDI channel. Uh, the bottommost one being channel 1, then channel 2, channel 3, and the uppermost being channel 4. The Keith McMillan Q Nexus is able to trigger all of these synths uh, independently with its MIDI channel rotation function. As an alternative, if you have a some sort of MIDI guitar, like this Chapman stick here, it's equipped with the Roland GK3 pickup. With this 13 pin cable, it is hooked up to the uh, Roland GR55 guitar synthesizer. If we were in a patch and we pressed edit, and normally we're on the tone uh, screen, we press, press arrow right and right and right and uh, we'd be over here on JK settings and you can press the not the page button but the arrow button over to the MIDI slash USB and then press enter and then you would page from general over to the G, uh, GTR to MIDI settings and I think by default the switch is off so we put that on and then going down to this line the mode is mono. Ahem. Got to get in tune first. Um, so, if you're in poly, you can trigger with the Chapman stick, all the strings will go to MIDI channel 1. And you can see the Moog Mother receiving that MIDI data when this little red light blinks. And that happens when I press a string on the fretboard. But when we go to the GTR and we set it to mono, what happens is, starting from the uppermost string, this string is set to MIDI channel 1, then 2, 3, 4, and 5, but I don't have that many Moog Mothers. <laughs> so here's that little red light and the little red light, and you'll see those going off. So the way this is hooked up, I've got the uh, just a regular 5-pin MIDI cable going from MIDI out into right here. And this little box is the quadra through from MIDI Solutions. And that's four separate channels then going into their respective MIDI ports on each mother. So that's it's kind of like a merger box where you can have one source control four different modules. And if I want to use the Keith McMillan, I just plug this cable back into the expander box, then start playing normal on keys instead of on strings. <laughs>